The one cent magenta has recently been auctioned by Sotheby's. However, the result of the auction was very surprising. Firstly, the stamp sold for $8.3 million, $1.2 million less than it sold for in 2014, and $1.7 million less than its lower estimate. Secondly, it sold to Stanley Gibbons, the biggest British stamp dealer. This is surprising as they showed no interest in purchasing the stamp before the auction, and as the stamp was worth nearly a third of their company, they have taken a huge financial risk. But most surprising is what they plan to do with it. Until now, the stamp could of course only be owned by one person at a time. But Stanley Gibbons are changing that by metaphorically splitting up the stamp and selling shares to people. This technique known as fractional ownership is already used for things like companies and precious metals, but it has never been used for stamps before. It has proven to be controversial, as some people believe that this defeats the object of stamp collecting. However, I personally like this idea as it means that the stamp is no longer out of the reach of the majority of collectors. It is not yet known how Stanley Gibbons are going to sell the shares. However, I believe that it is most likely that they will split the stamp up into 10 million sections, with each one costing a pound. If this is the case, I will probably buy a share. Let me know in the comments if you will.